Hey everyone, welcome back to our interview question and answer series on the service now. Today question is how do you restrict the data on reference field in service now? Okay, my example here is okay, whenever I am on incident page, this is the reference field. So it is it is referring to the user table. Okay, whenever I am clicking on it, it is showing 627 users, but here the actual users are 632. How the five users are not showing here, how it is getting filtered out, okay then the concept will be involved that is called the reference qualifier then let me show you quickly so then right click on the caller and go to the configure dictionary then this particular page will be opened and you can come down dictionary page will be open you can come to the reference specifications In the reference specification it is the column caller column is referring to the user table then you will be seeing one option called reference qualifier okay there are three type of reference qualifier with help of these three type of reference qualifier you will be restrict the data on the reference field mark okay if i go to the simple then conditional builder can be applied then you can be able to restrict the data so here active is true is applied then in this only false users false inactive users will be filtered out and showing whenever you are referring to the stable okay you can do it many for example here my requirement i wanted to add one more field then i will be adding add okay click on add then you can be able to uh, filter out with any okay for example here department okay for example let's do it with the department department is okay department is not empty okay then update it now whenever you are referring to that particular table the it will restrict the data it will filter out the data with this conditional builder and show it to you now refresh it okay and then you can click on this page okay i mean reference field then it will open it now you will be seeing 629 users okay so that is how you can do it for anything okay thank you so much thanks for watching